So, it's me, your little boy, A.K. Samson. I have something special, unique for us today. So, what I have for us is this. Reasons why they hate the choosing ones the most. <laughs> you know, nobody, the, the, the fact truth is this. No one hates for no reason. You know, I cannot just come out now and start to hate this book for no reason. Maybe it's not what my taste. Maybe I don't like, like, in, in, when it comes to pen, writing with pen, I prefer writing with what black pen. That's why uh, even in school, uh, it, it, it will be very difficult for you to see me write with blue pen. I prefer what red, what red pen like this. Because when I write it, I do what, whether the handwriting is good, it's not good, but that that black color it, it, it do what it make me feel good but anytime i write with what with blue it does not match my test mostly when i'm reading it you know what i'm saying so what i have five signs why they hate the choosing ones the most why they hated the choosing ones the most one they see you they see in you what they cannot see in them you know that last night I decided to jot everything down. You know what I'm saying? So listen, people will always hate you, whether your brothers, your friends, your relatives, they will always hate you as long as there's something that they see in you that they can't see in them. Example of it is Joseph. The moment the brothers of Joseph figure out what God have deposited in Joseph that was not in them that moment marked the beginning of hating <laughs> you got saying so when people are hating you don't just think that they hate you for no reason or maybe uh, the hating is for there is no purpose why they hate you there is accurately a reason why they hate you you got saying so another reason why they hate the choosing ones the most is because you are what noticeable admiring in your present what i mean is this you are noticeable and maybe you know mostly when i was in school in italy so we are up to i'm sure we are like 25 people in you no know, 25 africas like me you know so after some months so some of my friends start to ask me a question you know one of my best friends let me put it in this way that I take as a best friend, not knowing that he is not my what my friend. So it got to a point where this my friend asked me, because he said something, what have you done that made them to love you the most? You know what I'm saying? So I was so what I was I was shocked when this my friend asked me this question. He says, why is it that everybody in this school, both the ones in our class, both the ones that is not in our class, they prefer they prefer to do it, to mingle with you. They prefer to know you. Everybody in this place know you. What have you done? I keep on silent. You are what you are noticeable. No matter how you hide it, people will always notice you. And that is why they do it. They will always hate you. Mostly when you have friends that are always trying to show off, that are always trying to impress others. You know, like those days when I was in school, I'm that type of person that, if my friends, if this is a classroom, you know, if this is a classroom, I would prefer to do or to sit in this place where there is nobody. And some of my friends will circle from here, circle from here, then I will be alone here. So the reason why they circle all this place is because they want to attach with people, to make friends with them. But me that sit separate, you will see some of them, many of them will sneak little by little and they will come close to me some of them will be telling me something does that mean you don't like us does that mean you don't want to mingle with us or you don't want to you know associate with us i will just be tell, i will just tell them please not that i hate you people but my own ways of living is that i love to live alone i love to stay quietly because i don't want people to say you 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 do too big or you act too big or you are too proud or you talk too much so some of my friends start to ask me this question why is it that you are what you are too what noticeable and you you dominate your present dominate you know what i'm saying so another reason why they hated the choosing was the most is that you you are what defined and what determined 
what does that mean is this you remain what standing no matter what they do regardless of what they throw your way regardless of what may do it and what may come on your way you remain what at what at standard no matter what may do it may occur on your way no matter the conflict no matter the obstacle because sometimes people will throw some certain things on your way to see if preventure or if you will surely do it fall down but the moment they realize that regardless of what they threw or regardless of what they did you are still standing many of them will end up doing what hating you many of them will end up uh, trying to do or to put things against you so regardless of what you are divine no matter what you do what what you encounter and that will make them to hate you the most and another reason why they hated you the most as a student is that you double confirmation your double word confirmation what does that mean is this your double confirmation let me give you example of it if you know if you if you discover the what the life of joseph or if you can remember or let me reflect us you know the the the, the life of joseph the moment the brothers of joseph identified the mission of joseph i mean the purpose of joseph that mark what the hatred they start to hate him because when joseph was born they were living good life they were filled with happiness they were filled with kindness they love each other but the moment the double confirmation of joseph come true that marked the beginning of hatred what does that mean is this your own brothers your own sisters many of them will start to hate you the moment they figure out what you truly carry that is not in them you know what i'm saying so they will not hate you for no reasons so another reason why they hate you the most is because you are like able everybody like you everybody want to be like you everybody want to associate with you everybody want to do things with you no matter what it, how how hard things may be no matter what people are saying people people will surely do what like to mingle what with you example of it is what is called what? Easter Easter you know the moment the, uh, uh, despite of the hating of what of uh, of Haman towards Easter at the end they still do what they still find a reason to love what Easter so you are like able People will like you and some some people around you will hate you as long as a lot of people want to associate as long as many people love you some particular people around you will still have reason to hate you some of them will be like why you are what why why is it that people love you the most why is it that people are so caring why is it that everybody want to do or to be with you everybody want to associate with you so you are like able and that pissed a lot of people off that bothered them because they can't be like like you they can't be admired like you they nobody love them the way they love you nobody like them the way they love you they like you and that bothered them that pissed them off you know what i'm saying so this five reason is the main reason why they hate you the most let me add six of it one your present cover what their what their negative word set up what i mean is this you know there are some people who will come around you who will said ah let's put this asunder let's do this thing so that whenever mostly when they are talking bad of you behind the scene you know there are some places where people will know ah if this guy come to this place uh they will surely do it everybody will love him everybody will do this and because of that let's do this let's talk bad of him before he arrive you know that was when i was in school so there is one of my friends who do used to tell some of my friends you know they do used to talk bad of me behind the scene and some of my friends will tell me ah why is it that this guy is talking bad of you why is that this guy is trying to blaspheme you? And the moment I arrived, some of them said, Oh, this is not whom you are. You know what I'm saying? So no matter, no matter what they say behind the scene, you are what your present unlock their negative thought 
towards you and that beast majority of them what i mean is this they may talk bad of you but the moment your present arrive it reconfigure everything that they have said it tell them whom you are not what they have said about you you know what i'm saying so remember bless to me god bless you these are the reasons why they hated you the most may god bless you